This video will cover the topic, adding rational expressions with common denominators and monomial numerators. Wow, that's a mouthful. What does that even mean? Let's break it down. A rational expression is a fraction with a polynomial in both the numerator and denominator. So, 6 over x is a rational expression, and so is 6x squared plus 4x, all over 2y to the third minus y. In addition, when it is said that rational expressions have a common denominator, it means that they have the same denominator. Okay, that makes sense. So if two rational expressions have a common denominator, we can add the two numerators together, right? That's right. So even though this may sound complicated, whenever we see a common denominator, all we have to do is focus on adding the numerators. But what about monomials? Monomials actually simplify this process. Mono means one, so monomial is a single term like x, 5, or z. I think I understand now. Can we try an example? That's a good idea. In this example, we are being asked to subtract the two rational expressions, 8 over x plus 3 minus 1 over x plus 3. Why don't you tell me what we need to do? Okay, let me think. Well, since the denominators are the same, we subtract 1 from 8, right? That's right. Here, we would subtract 1 from 8 and keep the denominator the same. This will give us 7 over x plus 3, which is our final answer. Let's go ahead and try another problem. This problem is asking us to add the two rational expressions 1 over 2a plus 3 and a over 2a plus 3. Why don't you go ahead and solve this one? Okay, since the denominators are the same again, don't we add a to 1, making our final answer a plus 1 divided by 2a plus 3? Yes, you'd be correct. Great job! Let's take a look at one more problem. This problem is asking for us to subtract x over 5x plus 1 from 2 over 5x plus 1, and then add 4 over x plus 3. What do you think we should do? I know that we can add x divided by 5x plus 1 to 2 divided by 5x plus 1 because the denominators are the same, but I'm not entirely sure what we do with the 4 divided by x plus 3. That's a good question, because 4 over x plus 3 has a different denominator than 2 over 5x plus 1 and x over 5x plus 1. We can't combine it with the other two rational expressions using this method. So in this case, our expression will become 2 minus x over 5x plus 1 plus 4 over x plus 3, which will be our final answer. This final expression cannot be combined any further because 5x plus 1 does not equal x plus 3 meaning that the two remaining terms, 2 minus x over 5x plus 1 and 4 over x plus 3, do not have a common denominator and, as a result, cannot be combined. Okay, so just to make sure that I understand, when adding rational expressions with common denominators and monomial numerators, you add the numerators together and keep the common denominator, right? Yes, that would be correct. 